too excited and y'all gonna see me up. Hey, y'all can't even see. <laughs> another banger i'm back and i'm better of course as always okay guys so today i'll be doing the top knot bun i'm about to show all the short hair people how to do this y'all see how i got my stuff slick i'm gonna show y'all how to get it like this i've been getting camera shot y'all like sometimes i don't even know how to talk to y'all the correct way i'm forgetting what i'm about to say so birthday on saturday period can't wait scorpio gang what is up y'all my birthday is on saturday y'all period about to be grown about to be grown i'm gonna do a little birthday vlog also so that's the next video that's on the way if you're new to the channel can you please subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell above because once you watch this video you're gonna want to continue to do so period you're gonna want to continue to watch my videos as you should <laughs> Here I have pink lotion. You can get it from the beauty supply. It should be no more than $7.99. I'm then going to apply the pink lotion into my hair. Here I have Jamaican black castor oil. You can get this from the beauty supply for about $10.99. This one was on sale for $7.99. But if you know, you know. This here I have a disangular brush. You can get it from the beauty supply for about $3.99. Y'all guess who I'm listening to? He really be snapping. <laughs> Comment down below. I'm going to part my hair horizontally. As I said before, I like to section my hair off. Why? Because it's easier to do. Ooh, my parts be so bogus. Y'all already know how I'm coming with the parts. I can't wait until I learn how to do my parts the correct way. Here's my favorite edge effect, aka edge control. Then going to apply the edge control around the perimeter of my hairline. Steps are very repetitive, so I don't really feel like I should do much explaining. Here I have a hard brush. I'm gonna use this hard brush to brush my hair into place. Here I have Eco Styling Gel. You can get it from the beauty supply for about, I'll say, $5.99. I'm gonna use this ponytail holder to put my hair in the ponytail. This one of the big ones, as you can see, I have to wrap it around. You can use any ponytail holder. I wouldn't recommend rubber bands. I'm gonna add a little bit more eco, as you can see, my ponytail messed up. I'm gonna wrap my hair around twice. I'm gonna wrap my hair around the second time. Why? Because I like my ponytail to be tight and in place. Mm -hmm. 
I'm going to use a comb for coming into place. If you want your ponytail to be slick, you definitely got to use a comb at the end. I'm going to grab a piece from the middle, then I'm going to put in a ponytail. I put in a ponytail to make it look tall, to make it look bigger. I'm going to wrap it with a rubber band. You usually use bobby pins, but I don't have any bobby pins at the moment. I literally just had them and lost them. Oop, never mind, I found them. Then I'm going to put a little hair out and do my edges, period. <laughs> 